Where is it? Where's Queen Crimson's old curse? Should I? Or should I not? Should I? No. Broken promises being broken is a bad thing, but it's not worth it. But demise isn't worth it. What do you think, Gummy? Should I? Or should I not? Something tells me I shouldn't. Yet I have an urge to do it. I won't. It's not worth it. So, why did Twilight call us here again? <laughs> You're asking me. It didn't sound serious. <sighs> I'm here. Didn't get the message until earlier. Sorry. Sorry I'm late, everyone. I've called you all here because I want to show you something. I've called you here to this secret room in the castle and not many people know about it. And now I thought I would share it with you guys. I do lots of dangerous experiments in here, and that's why I don't show it to many people, so Pinky promised that you won't touch anything in here. This is the portal room in the castle. It's where I make portals, and this is why I've brought you here. This portal is the biggest out of all of them, and I don't know where it leads to. I wouldn't dare to go through this one myself. So, will you do me an extra favour and give me a little bit more courage and come with me? I don't know where it leads to. Of course, yeah. Okay, absolutely. Sure. Thank you. Where are we? Welcome to Equestria. Celestia! Wait, this is Equestria? Why, yes it is. Sorry if you seem a bit confused, just we must have time travelled from the past. Ah, oh, yes. At some point in your life, you will time travel to the future. Welcome to the year 2030. Life in Equestria is grand, and you have done many good deeds in your life. I'm very proud of you, Twilight. Thank you, Celestia. <laughs> Hi, Rainbow Dash. What are you doing here? Well, I've kind of changed my mind from what I said earlier. I'm quite sorry about that. So after a few bottles of Mountain Dew and a bag of Doritos, I have my energy back, so do you want to hang out? I guess you could say I'm reviving the promise. Oh my gosh, sure, um, sorry for getting a bit mad earlier, you know. It's okay, just give me a few minutes to get ready, and we'll go out. Okay. <sighs> Hi, I believe this is yours. Oh my gosh, my magical spear, thank you so much. You're welcome, I found it. Yay. Oh, thank you. Um, sorry for getting a bit mad earlier. It's alright. Bye. <sighs> Bye, Marzi. Pinky. Sorry about earlier, but I actually managed to print them off. Oh my gosh, you actually did. You're welcome. Sorry that the colours went a bit funny, though. It's okay, really. At least you printed them off. And sorry for getting a bit mad earlier. Broken promises aren't that big of a deal. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. But, um, Starlight says that she found a few extra cookies in the cookie jar, so if you want to come over to our place later and get a few cookies. Really? Thank you so much. I guess good things just don't come straight away, and they come to those with patience. So, if you're watching from the audience's point of view, I guess you could say that I learned to have more patience, as good things come to those with it. And fate being the balance between paradox and reality won't be in your hands if you don't involve black magic in something so small. Anyways, I'm glad I chose the right pill. And rather than creating disasters you just hope to fly out of, focus on doing things for yourself rather than others 24-7, as then you can become a real pie in the sky. Wait a second, pies don't fly.